What's happening everyone? It's me again, The Bean. You're watching Bean Screen TV. And we have a very special episode for you today. We went sight casting for my favorite triple tails. And we had a stellar day. Check it out. So on this day, we had a double date with me and my now fiance Astrid and my dad and Cynthia. And originally the plan was to go to the beach, fish the beach a little bit until the sun gets high enough to look for triple tails. But you know what? On the way to the beach, I saw a couple right off the bat. I was like, you know what? Change of plans. We're looking for triple tails now. All the triple tails. Where are they? Where are the triple tails at? My dad was first up to bat. He loves triple tailing about as much as me. And he got a great cast on it. Fortunately, it bit us off. Got him. Oh, he spit it. He bit the hook off. No way. Yeah. Holy cow. Wow. That's 40 floro and he just bit it off. Next up to bat, we had my fiance, Astrid, and we saw a really big triple tail. Now, she did exactly what was planned. She overcasted the triple tail, reeled it a shrimp right into the triple tail's line of vision. And as soon as he saw the shrimp, he got fired up and ate it. And this one was a moose. I wish the camera could do justice. Great job, it's a big one. Hey dad, get me uh, the net. Okay, cool. Very good job. Yeah. Oh, he's a big one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, holy cow, Astrid. Very good job, baby. Textbook. Nice one. Oh, oh, so cute. oh yeah. He's gonna get he's gonna flip out when he sees the boat. He might make a move for the motor. There you go. There you go. There you go. It's okay. There you go, gain. You may want to come up one more time. Like no. Yeah. Charlie, it's baby. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. There he is. <laughs> real, real, real. There you go. Real, real, real. Lift up. I know he's going to dig. There he is, baby. Look at that one. <laughs> Big triple tail for Ashton. Holy cow. Look at the size of that. Holy cow. I don't think you need the line. <laughs> <Hi>. <laughs> Great job, Astrid. Here I am with Astrid. Oh, I got my first keeper triple tail. Captain Bean put us on. Look at this stud, guys. Look at him. Let's go look for some more. My dad was up to bat. First cast. Perfect, right in front of that triple tail's face, and he was on. Look at that. Perfect. Perfect. Look at that one. Wow. <laughs> High five. Good job. Look at that. Whoa. Whoa. Now, triple tail, of course, one of my favorite fish, very prehistoric fish. They are tremendously strong. I mean, they have armor all throughout their body, sharp gill plates, as you can see, their spines, strong teeth. Those SRT Elites and those Akuma Helios Reels were a great combo for what we were doing. Astrid is a natural. We got another good one on. Oh, big one spooked right there. Keep your shrimp ready, Dad. Big one spooked right over there. Oh, yeah. Triple tail day. Here we go, Dad. I got the net. Are oh, you want to net it, Dad? Come 
That was a good one. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, look at that. There he goes. Oh yeah. Good moves, baby. Good moves, Astrid. Yeah. From Leia's head up, right there. That's the wrong shot. There you go. Great <laughs> job. Another big one. Another big one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that. Perfect hook set. <laughs> Wait. And that would have been, oh wow. And honestly, that's great also. I mean, sometimes you lose fish that way, not often, but you know, if a fish swallows the hook, this is a good way to keep your fish healthy. I see another triple tail over there. We're going to get lined up on this one. Mira, mira. <laughs> triple tail dinner, baby. That's it. I like it. Beautiful day out here in the Everglades. Ooh, Whoa! <laughs> oh! That thing just jumped like five feet out of the water. Oh my God! That one was. I've never seen one jump. Look at that! Oh my God! He went again. <laughs> like all of a sudden, this triple does went boom, and he's gained up on it quick. And like right as soon as he got tight back with it, that thing just went boom around the side, just like how they lay on their side, just just jumped on the side like a porpoise. It was it was unbelievable. It gets me so excited. Oh Bring him to you. Bring him to you. He's gonna make one more run. Yeah, another yeah, one. Yeah, I know he's gonna make one more run. Slide this way. Yeah. Reel down. Yeah, reel down. Now lift. Reel down. First set. There he is. Look at <laughs> that. Oh my god, what a toad! Holy cow! Wow, that one was fired up. This one made a couple spectacular jumps. I mean, fully out of the water, like four feet out of the water. And it is a big doormat. Look at the, oh my god. Look at that one. Hook is right there in the corner of the mouth. Eight pounder. Oh yeah. Biggest triple tail to date? Biggest mm. one to date for sure. <laughs> Cynthia's next. 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 Cynthia, next. you're up. So Cynthia was at the batter circle. She was up next. And this was actually the biggest triple tail of the day. Them. Port side. That might be the biggest one of the day. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, Cynthia. There you go. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Follow him. Follow him. Follow him. Had it. There you go. Oh. Look at the big one. Look at shark. 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 Out of nowhere, I saw this massive bull shark dorsal come up. And that thing was on all three of those triple tails tails. We had to muscle it in, just kind of cuff the spool, gave what he can, cuff the spool, gave what he can, and we luckily got it in the boat. Absolutely fantastic Happy. triple tail day. These are all beautiful specimens, really big fish. This one almost got got by a big bull shark. I saw his dorsal came up right next to the boat, and uh, but we saved it. We're eating triple tail dinner, not that shark tonight. <laughs> High five, Cynthia. Yep, 10 pounds on the boger grip. Down to the box. There we go. Look at that. Oh, yeah. All right, so. Hold on. There's four of us on the boat. We're only gonna keep four triple tail. You're allowed two per person. I don't want to keep that many. I just want to keep one for each of us so we can each have one to share, take home and eat. And I'm probably going to show you how I like to cook triple tail myself. So stay tuned, check it out. We decided to do what was originally our morning plan and go to the beach. We did that in the afternoon instead. Did a couple drifts along the beach around the shoreline and uh, just trying to look for a snook, red drum, sea trout, and only did it for about an hour or so, but we caught some really cool fish. Check it out. All right, folks, we're drifting along this beach out here in the Everglades, and uh, it's kind of a summertime thing. Fish kind of chase bay along this beach here. We got a nice sea trout on to start the day. Oh. Look at that. That was pretty cool. 
We're gonna go ahead and release this guy. Yeah, those teeth. Whoop! And there he goes. Oh yeah. There he is. Look at that. Look at that redfish. Great job. So yeah, we're just along this beach here. We got a beautiful redfish. We caught a sea trout earlier. Just spending a little time doing this after our triple tail action. And uh, this is a beautiful specimen, probably about probably about 24 inch redfish. And uh, we love seeing that here in the Everglades. And there she goes, nice and strong. Yeah, yeah. Great job on light tackle, pull and drag. We had some fun with that. Look at that, beautiful redfish. We safely released them, they swam way strong, and we packed up and went home so we can get our triple tail prepared for dinner. We got hashtag Billy the Kid here. He's gonna learn how to fillet a triple tail. Of course, triple tail are known for their thick skin and thick scales. So what I like to do is start here at the head. There. We got our backbone like that. Once again, towards the base of the tail. Pull the knife all the way through. Like so, all right. And then. Slide that knife right back up their back, though. This part of the tail right here. All right, and then when you get to the rib cage, around the rib cage, just like that. And boom, we got a triple tail play right there. You do the same thing to the other side. So triple tail are one of the hardest fish to fillet. So really take your time with them to get the most yield of the meat you can. Take this beautiful piece of triple tail in the kitchen and cook it up. See how it turns out. And now it's time for cooking with Chef Bean. First thing I do is get some butter, put it in a cast iron skillet, mince up some garlic. Add it to the butter in a skillet. Chop up some fresh basil leaves. And then while that skillet's getting hot, you get your fresh piece of triple tail. Add some garlic salt to it. Rub it in. Some pepper. Some Old Bay seasoning. Rub it all in. Make sure the butter and garlic and basil is all evenly spread out through the pan. And then just lay your filet right on top of all that. Add 
and then repeat on the other side. Some garlic salt, some pepper, and some Old Bay seasoning. Now one thing that's very important is that you don't overcook the fish. When you go pick up the filet to start cooking the other side, spread that butter around evenly across the pan. You can kind of watch from the sides to see the filet getting cooked. And then that's it, voila. All right, we just seared each side of that triple tail for a little bit. Just put, like I said, salt, pepper, Old Bay seasoning, and some butter in a cast iron skillet. Look at that flaking apart. Look at that. Perfect. And when you got fresh fish, it's better to slightly undercook it than slightly overcook it. Mm. It really doesn't get too much better than that. So simple, so delicate, so flaky and firm. Absolutely perfect. All right, I'm gonna go enjoy the rest of this now. All right, that's it everyone. You've seen it, you heard it, I'm done. I'm sure you're done as well. You're tired of looking at me and listening to me. But make sure you smash that like button until your finger breaks. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you come fish with me. I hope you enjoy. That's it, I'm out. See ya. Today, but oh. it yeah, it didn't rip the gap out of my hands either. Oh, take a good picture. Okay. Oh, yeah. My engagement with Astrid, my fiance. Now, no, let me just reword that. Huh? Here you go. <laughs> All right, so I think you're the mouth. Got it? Ready? Oh. All right. Great. What a beautiful Great specimen. Picture.